guys. So, nakawi tayo ng maaga. So, get a chance to go somewhere. But before that, let me change my clothes first. Let's go! So, nandito na tayo ngayon sa ating destination. We are here at Fort Canning. So, we'll go and room around and see kung ano nandito. Hi guys! So, we already started uh, moving around. Fort Canning. So, hindi pa tayo nakalahati. And I'm already sweating. So, uh, ma-amaze ka talaga. Always be amazed of what Singapore has to offer. Kasi, despite being a highly urbanized country, despite being a first world country, they were still able, they were still able to preserve all of this. Kita huh? nyo naman, di ba? Ang daming trees. And just behind me, those are like skyscrapers, guys. There, here. I don't know if you can see it, but I, those are skyscrapers, tall buildings everywhere. But can you imagine this? Like all of these trees there, and parang in the middle of a urban jungle. So, uh, despite being a small country, Singapore is uh, smaller. Actually, smaller than Bohol. Bohol is around 4,700 square kilometers, and Singapore is only around 700 plus, if I'm not mistaken. No wonder Singapore is called a, uh, it's a green city because they were able to preserve all these trees. So, hopefully, Philippines will also be able to do the same thing. Right in urban areas, right uh, in Manila, you can still see trees around you. So, hopefully, hopefully. So guys, dito pa rin tayo sa Fort Canning. I think nakalahati na tayo. Oh, parang, ex parang exercise din to. Kasi sobrang laki ng park. Kung iikutin mo siya, para ka nalang nag-hike. Ayun, sobrang pawis na pawis na ako. For those who wanted to um, visit Fort Canning and gusto nyo ikutin talaga lahat, you have to bring an extra shirt with you. Kasi pagpapawis na talaga. So, let's continue. Lighthouse. So later, I'm gonna show you. Actually, nasa nanya.
yun yung uh, Raffles Garden. Kung titignan mo, para siyang para nasa Bali ka. Hindi pa ako nakapunta nun, but I've seen pictures of uh, uh, yung very famous or Instagramable na uh, spot uh, dun sa Bali. And Guys, we are at the Artisan's Garden. So I don't know what exactly it is, but as you can see there. Up, 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 up. Did I need So we are at Artisan's Garden. So what was Singapore like before Sir Thomas Stamford Raffles landing in 19, 1890, 1819? Contrary to the common belief that the island was a fishing village without much history, Singapore was once home to a thriving ancient kingdom. We explore this very different historical narrative today with the aid of archaeology. The other sites have now proven the existence of a one, a once flourishing settlement actively involved in regional maritime trade in the 14th century. So it seems like uh, artisan garden means like uh, ito yung mga artifacts, I believe, if I'm not mistaken. So as you can see, there are a lot of artifacts there. So my amaze ka talaga because there are a lot of things that you can see here in Singapore. Tapos na natin ikot din yung Humboldt County and medyo nagabihan na tayo. Uh, again, for those who wanted to visit the place, uh, I suggest you bring with you an extra shirt, a bottle of water, and a comfortable shoes. <music> 